My name is Dennis McGrath, and I'm a photographer based in Los Angeles, California. Photography is more about like, it doesn't matter what camera I'm using at all. I don't care really. I think it's all about capturing like a moment or whatever it is, and that's really what's most important. Film, digital, it doesn't really matter. And my newest collab is Holiday 2015. We did three t-shirts, three pairs of socks, and a hoodie. I'm really psyched on the socks. It's, <laughs> I think the socks are the coolest thing I've ever had a photo on. I was driving and I kind of saw something happening on overpass. Two, this couple walked up. I have two, and I took with the iPhone, just driving, going like 50 miles an hour or whatever. I took a photo when they were just standing there, like, and then they stepped up on the curb, held hands, and just like walked up to the fence and stood there. And there was someone standing behind them. Maybe they were shooting something. It was all happening so fast. But boom, boom, two iPhone photos, bam, nailed it. And that's just something that I think that living in Southern California, you see every day, kind of see like weird shit up on the 101 overpass. So I shot Sasha Gray, who was a friend of ours at the time, so and I shot, she was one of the girls I wanted to shoot. And what's interesting about this picture too, I think, is it's, it's I was shooting film and digital, and it was a film photo where my flash didn't go off, and I wanted it to, but then that's the kind of weird accidents that happen when you're shooting film that I think that don't happen with digital. The light's real weird, it's, her face kind of dark, but that's what's rad about it. The skeleton photo, it's funny because that was, everyone always, at, people love that picture so much, and I never really thought much about it until I, until it was in Hamburgerized, actually, and then people were like, oh wow, that picture's great. Um, it was just a skeleton in someone's yard, and I took a photo of it. I had my point and shoot camera in my pocket. It was one of the things I think is kind of cool about it. It's pretty simple. The photo of the girl with the Emi tattoo on her lip is from Ybor City. It was one year, Tampa Pro 2001. And in Ybor City, they have this festival that's kind of like a fake Mardi Gras or something for St. Patty's Day and everyone wears beads and shit. And it's just like a party town. And we were just at a bar one night and that girl was really rad, sweet chick. And she was had just hanging out with a bunch of us. Ended up, And then her girlfriend showed up and she was like, they were like total lesbians. And that was the whole idea of having to eat and catch on her lip. My friend Andrea from San Francisco, she's just the raddest young chick, I don't know, and she skates and stuff. Anyway, we just became friends like kind of immediately. And one day I remember she like texted me, slammed going down a hill and she sent me a cell phone photo on the bus of her legs just skinned up, like all bloody, like gnarly. She had this cute outfit on, she had like her socks pulled up and some nice shoes and a dress and stuff. And in the end it was just funny, I was like, oh shit, and I just was like, let me take a picture of your legs because they're all skinned up. It's a pretty rad photo. And the fact that she's like, it's this girl that's all beat, skinned up from skating.